Good morning everyone. Um, I basically bought a new test meter today um, and I just wanted to do an unboxing uh, with you because I've never used this, this brand before. Um, they're quite a, a good brand in the test meter market um, for the small like Steinle testers but for like multifunction tester um, I've never used this this before um, and it's a relatively good price and it's also advertised uh, for sale on the NICIC website so um, if they're promoting it it must be it must be pretty good um, so I'll, I'll show you the unboxing of it I've not unboxed this yet I don't know exactly what you get in it other than what it says on the cover um, so we'll unbox it together and uh, you can see see where you're getting it Okay guys, this is the new DL911X series 18th edition multifunction tester. Um, I don't know the exact differences for the 18th edition on this. Um, I'm sure it's a little bit of a gimmick, but the, um, there's probably a couple of little changes in there with the RCD um, testing function and things like that, but I uh, don't actually know the differences. Uh, but it's a relatively good price, so we're going to see what you get in the box, basically. Okay, let's go. Well, I've not opened this yet. Um, first of all, you get the you get quite a nice, nice box. It's quite like the fluke, fluke tester, um, which is good. Okay, you get a top lid which unclips which is quite handy oh it's even got a little little catch so that sort of stays there i don't think that would last long to be honest um there we go but even so that's still quite handy for some little bits and bobs any fly leads or anything like that you've got something small and then up on the side it opens up as you can see it's got a, a waterproof seal um, around the edge of the box, you can just about see that, that blue seal, so keep it warm. Looks like a strap. Put in the bag. We've got our three probes, our three leads, three crocodile crypts. Also we've got our Plug in, plug in lead, bag of batteries, and a spare fuse. That's everything on the top, the top shelf. So I'll take that off. Ooh, documents enclosed. I'm assuming that's the calibration certificates. Um, I'll have a look at that in a minute. And there's the test meter. All a nice rubber foam uh, foam casing. So you get the test button F1 to 4. On here, uh, you know, your voltage and your, your frequency. Insulation test 250 and 500. Um, so it doesn't do a thousand. Uh, you got your co uh, continuity, that's your off setting. Uh, you got your loop, two loop settings, so you got your ZS and ZE. You got your non trip and your high. There, uh, you your, the four RCD test modes there, but the top one is an automatic function. It will test it all for you basically. Um, you just keep switching the breaker back on. And finally, you've got your ramp test. Uh, this is a, a good feature. So when you do put RCBOs in, you can get a, do a ramp test, uh, and it will tell you the the tripping um, current of that in milliamps of of that RCBO. Um, and so a lot of them are around 21 milliamps, and so not 30 milliamps. So that's quite an interesting an interesting thing. So you have to when you design your, your system on what the use is going to be for on the ring main. Um, that's a good good test to do to see what um, see what the RCBO is. Uh, yeah, so 
Um, overall, it's looking pretty, pretty good. It's quite rugged. A little bit rubbery on this, quite rubbery this yellow. You know, thing, but it's um, this for your test probes. But yeah, it feels pretty good and solid. That's everything in now. I've just noticed actually. You can get, oh, I thought it was in the box. It said included. Ah. Uh, they've done me, it's not in this, uh, it's not in this pack. It says included, remote test probe. Uh, 9118 only. Hmm. Interesting. Okay. I'll um, look into that one. But uh, yeah, so overall, looked quite good. Um, you seem to get everything you need in the computer apart from the test probe. See what's in the uh, envelope. Operating instructions. Extended warranty service plan. Extend your warranty. Sixty-five pound. And I'm assuming this is the conformity test certificate calibration. Yeah. And you've got all your your readings and stuff on there. So yeah. Overall, pretty good. Um, the only disappointing bit was was the probe. I, I, I hope that that probe was in there, the test probe. Um, unfortunately not. Maybe that's why it's a good price. Um, so yeah, I'll, maybe I'll do another video when I've done some testing with it and get, uh, do a review on um, and what what it's like um, and how how it performs. But yeah, great. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see. You. Leave your comments below, and I'll try and answer anything. Uh, any questions you've got on this test meter uh, so i will eventually do a another review on it uh, once i've used it uh, for my opinion see you in the next video see you guys